you miss, pal. <laughs> Ah, that's a coal barrel. Forgot about them. Wow, Sylvan Height armor. Nice. Cheers, dude. I hate that you can't block people with this. I wish. How much was the kick actually depleting your stamina? Fair bit. Is that he's a mimic? Can't yeah, really remember. Just a normal attack, doesn't The double doors have like 60 stability. It's not very good. There you go. It's not a ton. It's basically the reason this isn't very good. It's just hilarious. Smooth great hammer. Hmm. And the Lion Ring. I like the Lion Ring. Don't really need it though. For some weird reason the Silver Knights drop a lot of large Titan Iron. I'm not quite sure why. Yeah, it's funny I actually felt that even though I was quite a way away from you then. Sorry, uh, finger slip. Yeah, guy with the big shields can go in head, I guess. As we've got uh, summoning doggies. Or whatever they are. <laughs> like, not because we start. Why? She hit me! That's because Candace is hugging you. Behold the cycle of hatred. Bloody dogs. You can open up the shortcut. I don't know if I can even use this lift at the top, we'll see. Bye! Oh, I can. Nice. Hmm. Good job there, you almost got me killed. <laughs> Part of me was wondering if I could get you to walk off the edge without looking. Leviathan, you're allowed free hits on Ka uh, Leviathan. Where did he even go? Somewhere. He's hiding with his traitorous friends up ahead. Now, do to me, Leon. Yep. I love this hat. <laughs> Could this be the work of the enemy stand? Something will look out place and it's him. Is that one there? There, 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 there. Alright, let's let Moltog guess. I don't know. Gotta be this one. <laughs> now, I won't say I'm getting cold damage here at this rate, but that's kind of full. It doesn't do damage to you, just get frostbit. Well, frostbit does damage to you, though. I have a pretty good idea which one he is. I have to protect the host. 
What weapon was that, by the way? That was kind of neat. It's the weapon you get from this place. Alright. Oh, is it one of the pontiffs? Or is it just one of the uh, ethereal guards? Pontiff Knight Curved Sword. <laughs> Alright, front door's open at least. Great type of painting. Yep, Pontiff Sullivan. Oh no, you can get one of the rings. Down here. Uh, but the guys are all alive again down there. It's only the... Some... Hey, you have the shortcut, don't worry about it. It's the miracle ring, right? Yeah. Yeah, I think it's the Second first one. Second yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. Smooth. I guess I'll heal him again. Thank you, dear, as I only have five Estus. Pontiff Sullivan. This entire game. I actually enjoy. I really like the fight with Pontiff Sullivan. That's probably one of the best fights in the game. Oh, uh, it's parryable. Yeah, I it's only one of his attacks is parryable. There's actually quite a few of them. No, sorry, let me rephrase that. You can only parry one of the swords. If he attacks the other sword, you can't parry him. Well, he attacks often enough with the right hand, so it's fine. Anyway, let's do some fight that, and I think I actually put the wrong uh, things on my blades, but whatever. <laughs> Here's the uh, Carthus Rouge under my blades, but I'm pretty sure he's immune to bleed damage. <laughs> I think it's magic he wanted to use against him. I can't remember, actually. Tell us when to walk outside and put our things down, because I guarantee some of us are going to get invaded. Welcome home, I speak. Well, you don't have to be empty. So high level, to... you're probably not gonna invade it. Very well, then take. You'll well past me. Range. It scales it. Remember? I mean, no, it doesn't. Not if you get invaded. To invade you, they have to be roughly your level. That's still how it works. Oh. It only oh. scales when you have the password and you're doing the welling inv invasion shit. That's why I can't invade Molda with Red Phantom. Because he's way below my level. It scales up though, or that you can invade someone way above your level. Alright, let's send you out again, Grey Rat. Mm -hmm. Oh, hey. Either way, I haven't been invaded here in a long time. If the so tales of what do you... I'm sure mm, something's I fucking with that. It probably prefers people who are actually around your level, but. Like, I don't see any summoning signs out here. And I'm level 170 something. Or 80, I think.
Goodbye. I do stay safe. You. <laughs> right, right, right. Have fun. Please don't get yourself killed. I think Patches is here now as well. Back again, I, I suppose. That Patches should have gone okay. there after uh, Temple of the Deep. I can't even think where he sits though now. Oh, right, I remember now. I don't think there's anyone else out of the... Oh, the, well, there is one person, but I haven't seen them yet, which is odd. I might have missed him, actually. You have, you can make better... Oh. I don't remember which one. Uh, well, I'm also going to get my health self Oh, wait, no. I'm going to get the cat's ring first. Make life easier for myself. Like Crayon, then. Yeah, I'm just going to fight Crayon. So, there is, um, where the bridge is, there should be a summon sign down, which, um, has, uh, Siri on it. Uh, and she needs help. You'd get the same thing if you went to help, say, Amri, um, at the top of the tower. Uh, she'll have a few stones down, um, a few prism stones, and, um, you have to help her with the El Eldritch fight. Why it says you've been summoned to another world? You're not really. Te well, technically you are, and you aren't. It, yeah. yeah. Otherwise, you just are. It's the same mechanic. Yeah. Oh, Crichton. Had a divine blessing with him. Thank you for your kind assistance. Blessing of the moon upon your journey. So, uh, Crichton's gear should be around here somewhere for now for killing him. Um, Crichton's gear shows up, don't I think you have to kill him first, in, as a, when he invades you. Oh, then you get his armor. I thought you just have to help in her. about that. The body along here is well I thought it was that anyway. Yeah, it's not there. 
Maybe right. I'm just going to see if I can find him again in the second bonfire. Oh, no, you can't get invaded by any of this kind of stuff if, unless you have uh, your embed. I probably haven't made that apparent yet, though. <laughs> Should I put down my thing now? No, I'll give it a minute. Okay. Weird. No invasion at all from crying. Do I have to go and help us straight away at the um, other area now, or do I have to finish the next boss beforehand to help Siri again? Do you have the Dark Moon uh, loyalty gesture? Loyalty gesture, yeah. And you just helped her kill him in her world? Crichton, yeah. He should be there. You might have to reload the area, maybe. Try talking to her again. She's back at the firelink, so. Hmm. I have not thanked you for your generous oh. rescue. That dark spirit was one of Rosaria's fingers. Vile bastard offspring who lurk in the darkness. My sworn enemies. Fearsome invaders, to say the least. I would not have made it alone. You have my deepest gratitude. If you require help on your travels, I offer you my sign. Blessing of the moon upon your journey. Oh, I've got a cat ring now. <laughs> you can add, ah, that's a point as well. There's a Another person you have to talk to later down the line, and you won't actually be able to talk to them unless you have the Dark Moon loyalty sign. <laughs> you can talk to them, you just have to run the covenant. Yeah, well, yeah, it's needed, I should point out, yeah. Try one more time, Lucrae. Basically, no one's ever been summoned by it anyways. It's very rare. They're pretty much the blues, what, what convert into the blues anyway, the Dark Moon. Well, yeah. The other one is the Green Sentinels. Ah. Green Sentinels. Fuck, what the fuck is it? Blue Sentinels and the Blade of the Dark Moon are the two covenants that are essentially the same covenant. Though you do see a changeover, like, when you get to the Dark Moon zone, but... It may see, when you actually get help from a Dark Moon, you'll see them, but otherwise not. No, no invasion from him. Probably just broke it because there were so many of us. <laughs> no, shouldn't have anything to do with it. Oh well, it don't matter. It's not like it's not necessary that invasion on on me anyway. I helped her out for what I wanted, so. I uh, oh, I'm, I'm gonna head up, have a quick walk up to the top of the tower. Oh, I can do that later, actually. I'll. Uh, I'm I'm ready now for Pontus Sullivan, so I'll get your signs down. This is gonna be a shit show. <laughs> Wiki says he doesn't invade if you've already killed Pontiff. Oh, mm, so we miss I missed my chance then in other words. I don't matter. It's only It's only I think you get his armor, don't you? And his axe. I'm not sure about his armor actually. You get his axe and then you can buy his armor. Yeah, nah, it's not about it then. Uh, that up there, we'll be we going there eventually.
Hey, Wait. where's my sign? Well, I've got Steve. I haven't seen Leviathan yet, though, or uh, uh, Candlos. Oh, it's tabbed out still. Yeah, I heard it. I'm, uh, I'm, well, I shouldn't be too bad, but I'm, I'm using push to talk on my remote, so that might be why. Sometimes it don't connect correctly. Alright, I threw down my sign. Weird thing is, though, in this area, there aren't that many blood stains. It's usually a lot worse. <laughs> I see, like, 12. I, I only like have 20. 3, 4, 5 I have. That's it. There's 5 down for me. Basically, the entire low ground is characteristically covered in blood for me. Yep. Classic question. Why are there so many blood stains? I wonder. Ah. I'm gonna have to drop I'll someone. I'll put down my sign just outside the entrance. Yeah, I just dry fingered though. I can only summon two people here. What I do? Well, I, oh, well, Leviathan can go red if you want. Better dead than red. Okay, you're not coming then. <laughs> <laughs> uh, where's the next place I can be summoned? <laughs> Nowhere. I don't think so. The whole Anolondo area is only two people. Well, okay, so should I just go downstairs then? 